We're starting this bulletin with the biggest story coming from India. The coronavirus crisis worsens as India reported more than 323,000 cases in the last 24 hours, with more than 2,700 deaths. This is the sixth consecutive day when India has reported more than 300,000 cases. But this is the first time in the last few days that the daily infection figures have reduced from the past reported numbers. But experts caution that this may be due to less testing. In the last year, India was among the few countries to report the lowest fatality numbers. But in the last few weeks, the figures have risen. India has recorded more than 2,000 deaths for the sixth day in a row, now nearing 3,000. Hospitals across India are reporting a shortage in oxygen supply as well as ICU beds. The transportation of medical oxygen became a crucial issue. Indian railways undertook the swift running of the Oxygen Express as a challenge. It had delivered nearly 450 tons of oxygen by Tuesday morning, and over 90 tons of oxygen is currently en route. The special train has already supplied crucial oxygen to places like Delhi, Lucknow and Jabalpur. In wake of the surge in infections, as well as the transmission rate recorded, on Monday, member of the government's policy advisory body, Niti Ayog, Dr. V.K. Paul, said that people should start wearing masks even inside their homes and try not to invite anyone over. और बल्कि अब मैं कहना चाहूंगा कि सीधा टाइम आ गया है कि घर में हम वैसे ही अब मास्क पहनना शुरू करें हम बाहर की बात करते थे लेकिन संक्रमण जैसे है ज्यादा है तो घर में भी बाई चांस किसी को आ गया है तो जहां तक हो गए घर में भी जब हम किसी के साथ बैठे हैं तो मास्क लगाएं तो फायदा है लेकिन डेफिनेटली अगर कोई पॉजिटिव है उसको भी मास्क लगाना है बाकियों को भी लगाना है उसको दूसरे कमरों में रखना है एस केसेस कंटिन्यू टू राइज मोर एंड मोर कंट्रीज हैव बैंड एयर ट्रैवल फ्रॉम इंडिया more than 17 countries have either imposed a travel ban on India or have taken precautionary steps and have issued advisories against travelling to or from India. Australia has joined a host of nations like the US, Canada, Singapore, UAE, UK, France, Germany and Italy. India's recovery figures remain promising. Out of the total 17.6 million people infected, more than 14.5 million have recovered. Even as India battles its deadly second wave, its vaccination program goes on unabated. India has administered more than 145 million vaccine jabs to date. India is all set to begin its third phase of vaccinations from the 1st of May, under which everyone over the age of 18 will be eligible to receive the vaccine. Registrations for the third phase begin from the 28th of April. Keeping the surge in mind, the Indian government has advised citizens to register online on the Cowin platform. Earlier today, we spoke to Dr. Navit Wig, chairman of the All India Medical Institute's COVID Task Force and the head of the medicine department. Dr. Navit Wig shared some advice to help people deal with the ongoing virus crisis in the country. Be in touch with your doctor. Telemedicine facilities, we have to increase a lot in the country at this moment. Please do not panic. Only few patients go to, need to go to hospital. And if you need to take your first dose of steroids, if advised by a doctor, please take at home. So my only request is we have to break the chain. I have to ensure that person sitting in front of me is wearing a mask. It is my responsibility. Everybody has to share a responsibility. Again, I am going to micromanagement. I am going to district. I am going to sub-district. Please take care of your sub-district. Please take care of your mohalla. Ensure that nobody is without mask. And pull. And I, I want fine should be imposed. It is must that we impose a fine if mask is being not mask. Nobody is if anybody is not wearing a mask. I am not saying to harass public, but current moment is we have to break the chain, otherwise hospital will remain overwhelmed. I can assure you, please take vaccination. Everybody, every Murray must take their vaccination whenever it is due. If your first dose is due, take the first dose. Second dose is due, take the first dose on time. There are no problems. 
even if infection occurs in few percentage of patients no problem this infection is not going to be very very it will it will cause you very mild to moderate illness it will not cause you severe illness please protect yourself use vaccination to help yourself use vaccination to help yourself please take it just ensure that since it is summer time hydrate yourself well hydrate yourself well and if fever comes after vaccine just take a paracetamol tablet and you will be fine so my request is mask 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 other request is vaccinate 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 third thing is don't panic don't panic don't panic i can say 3 weeks if you do less than 5% in all districts if you do restrictions in all districts who have positivity rate of more than 5% in 3 weeks you should be able to manage it healthcare facilities will be less burdened patients will be there will be less panic so please give 3 weeks of time to control to break this chain so ultimate aim is break the chain break the chain and break the chain